Hey, it's James Wilson Taylor here for Rock Sound, joined once again by Spencer and Aaron from Under Earth. Hello, guys. Hello, sir. Hello. Hi, nice to see you. So we're going to play a little game now. We play what's a band's called First Time Last Time. Very straightforward. I put out a scenario. You tell me the first time you did that and the last time you did that, or the most recent time you did that. Very, very simple. Easy one to start with. What was the first album you ever bought and the most recent album you bought or are streaming because it's 2018? First album I ever bought? Mm, man. On my on my own dime, probably Nirvana Nevermind. Solid choice. Very solid. I choice. was Nevermind as well. Wow. I think well, I had albums before that, but I think they were all my dad's or my brother's. Yeah, I yeah, think that yeah. was the first one that I got as a little kid. Nice. Last album. If we paid for it if you paid for it to be Nevermind, but I, yeah. the first album I ever had was Pet Sounds. Oh wow. Well. was given to me, so. Yeah. yeah, it was like kind of born into a household full of Led Zeppelin records. So. Right, right, right. Um, the latest thing I've bought. Or are streaming. I mean, everyone always gets stuck on this. Have you heard of a bank? Have right? you heard of a bank called Dawes? No. D a w e s. Uh, that's the last record I bought. It came out a few months ago. Oh, it's cool. called. It's called um, Passwords. Dawes is. You should look up Dawes. Awesome. Really good band. They tour. They just toured with Bob Dylan. It's kind of like a. It's not folky at all. It's like rock and roll, but they they're on tour with ELO right now. Oh wow! Yeah, they get the Big most mix. random tours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, that's cool. The la I mean, the last record I streamed, the last record I bought was, I think, Tell Me I'm Pretty, Cage the Elephant. But the last one, I mean, I'm, I stream, I try to check out everything that's new. That's cool. Like, uh, every day that I go to the, I go to the gym, like, pretty much six days a week, and I <coughs> always, if something's new out, I want to check it out, even if it's not my personal right, right, taste right. or style. So, what, what's, so on, what's on the gym playlist now, then? What's, uh, uh, well, I just, the, the two new Thrice singles, uh, the new Bring Me song came out yesterday, and the two Bear Tooth songs, and just I just I just kind of keep up with my friends yeah, or peers. Like I'm always gonna listen to something that comes out, especially if it's in our genre at all, because I just I'm always curious like what what my homies yeah, are up to, or, on, or even what people that I don't know that are playing similar music and you know, working for the same goal as me. So I'm just, no, I'm course. always checking out uh, whatever's new if I can. Nice. That's a good mix though. Definitely. All right. Let's do first gig you ever went to and most recent gig you went to that you weren't on the lineup for. First gig I ever went to was probably Code 7 uh, when I was a little kid. It's a band from North Carolina. Uh, if you look them up, they're, they're, they were on Equal Vision, I think, at the end. They were at the end, yeah. Dancing Echoes, it's like an incredible record, but that's what they did at the end. But the yeah, they never, they, never, they never left the States. Yeah, Code but 7. But they had like a small cult following. Yeah, they, they were like older than us, and uh, you know, like I said, I had older brothers, and they would take me to shows. I wasn't really allowed to go, but I eventually got to go, and uh, they were like kind of metalcore at first, and they became this like space rock band, but I was just always intrigued by that band and, and loved everything they did. The singer was fantastic. That was the first show I ever went to. The latest show that I went to that I didn't pay for. I mean, that I wasn't on the lineup. Mm. Yeah. Do you get a chance to check much bands out? I mean, a lot of people do I say, went, to be fair, when they're off the road, the last thing they want I, to do is go I, to a gig. I, <laughs> I know I just talked about this band, but me and my girlfriend drove... To Fort Lauderdale from St. Pete and saw Weezer and Cage the Elephant. Uh, they played on the beach. It was a really cool. show. Yeah. Solid. It was a very cool. It was like a radio thing, but it, it was cool. It was like the main stage was on the beach, and it was it was a lot of fun. First show I went to, I was 14. It was like a local hardcore show. The bands don't need to be named. Um, and the show, the last show I went to was right before we came over here to do festivals. We came over here in June. May June to do yeah. festivals. That's about right. uh, I went and saw Ryan Adams at oh, a at a at an right, outdoor right. amphitheater. It was amazing. Yeah, that's awesome. yeah, very very cool. All right, we'll do one more. What was the first song you ever learned to play, and the most recent song you learned to play that's not one of yours? So most recent cover, I suppose. We just did Heart Shaped Box for yeah, a bunch of on that radio thing we were talking about earlier. Oh yeah yeah yeah. I knew how to play as a kid, but this is yeah, the first we, we, cover we've learned to play um, together. Acoustic Nirvana. Very yeah. nice. It was it was it turned out really cool. Yeah, the first song I learned to play oh, was shit in here. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Jesus Christ. I know. I the first that. song I think I ever learned was probably Smells Like Teen Spirit on Same. guitar. Same. Wow, and we're in double Nirvana yeah. 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 after these. Wow. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. I, like, yeah, I basically learned every Nirvana song as a kid. Probably smells like Teen Spirit was the first, or no, I think about a girl was first because it was only two chords. Yeah, that's the but I feel like every. But I was, but I, I was, was playing. So I was playing drums like in my parents' church and stuff by then. But I had picked up a guitar, 
And I feel like at that time, anybody who went to like the local guitar shop in the states was playing. Smells yeah, like teen spirit. I learned. I learned. You about walk it. through the shop, it was like. Bow, nah, bow, nah, bow, nah. I'm yeah. sure it was the same here. Yeah, well, of course. Yeah. Of course. I started playing guitar in first grade. Uh, it was a little tiny, and yeah. I, I couldn't do bar chords until I was a little bit older because my I was just so small. Right. So about a girl was the two chords. It was the E and the G, and that's all I knew because I only knew the open chords at first, the yeah. uh, four open chords, and I just the verse riff. I didn't. I couldn't play the chorus because bar chords as well. But that came later. Yeah. Yeah. But that was the first. Nice first. first. A great mix. A great mix. Shout to Nevada right there, uh, Spencer and Aaron. Good to see you. Thank Cheers. you very much.